What's poppin' YouTube? Welcome back to the video blog. One more time, Hoxton Trend. Guys, quick review on this one, man. Just got some TNs in, and it's been, I think it's just been just over a year, or maybe just under a year, <clears throat> since I did my last uh, Nike TN review, the Nike Tuned or the Air Max Plus as it's sometimes known as well. And I've got those in guys to do a quick review. I thought let's have a recap and have a look at some of the new season's colors. The last unboxing I did for these trainers um, was the, obviously the last season's colors and now there is a mix of new season colors coming in. So I wanted to show you guys because a lot of people have been asking. And if you followed me on Snapchat, you would have seen that I put the pictures up and I ordered two red trainers instead of just one. So I've just come back from Foot Locker in Stratford. I've done an exchange and I actually exchanged them for these black and um, yellow ones right here, which look really cool. So I'm going to do a quick review, guys. Remember, if you like the vids, please continue to like, man. I would love to see at least 100 likes on this video. So that way I would know that you guys are enjoying it. And if you haven't subscribed yet, guys, might as well subscribe, man, because I've got lots more stuff coming, okay? So let's roll out, man. Let's do this. So first color we got here is this red colorway right here. Bam, let's just have a quick look at the color. Um, so this is known as University Red and White, and I've got these in. So many red trainers running around now, man. So red really seems to be the theme ever since. Um, I've always been rocking red, but I think ever since that um, Drake video with the red Maya, lots of people have been going a bit crazy and a little bit more brave to wear red. But yeah, these are the red ones right here. We can see the tuned system right here. Now, funny enough, I don't really know too much about this tuned system. I did try to do some review online, but when you type in Nike Air Tuned or um, Plus One on Google, by the time you get to the third or fourth um, search result, you're starting to see um, counterfeit counterfeit um, listings on Google. So that's really annoying. So I didn't get too much information. But the tunes um, system is meant to be some type of um, cushioning system. So when you walk on that, it's meant to be extra comfortable. And we've got the air bubble there that's going all around. Very cool trainer, man. Originally released in 1998. I remember when I was in school, these were hugely popular back then. So many people had them. And they were even seen as a bit of a fuggish trainer, a bit of a road man trainer. But, um, yeah, so many people have adopted them. They're very popular in places like London, Europe, and ap apparently they're huge in Australia. So yeah, so cool. But this colorway is really nice, as you can see right here. I really like this one. Um, just having a quick look at them, just thinking, what is my favorite colorway? And I think I actually think it's the black and yellow. And I don't even usually go for black trainers, but these look really, really nice. They're quite an intimidating trainer. I mean, in the sense that you, you gotta be a bit brave to rock TMs. It's not something that everyone would rock. I don't think everyone likes these trainers. I think they're absolutely wicked. Um, yeah, I think they can be a bit loud, but I reckon with some nice shorts, these would look wicked. I just can't imagine what jeans I'd wear these with. I think they're a bit too bulky for jeans. I think these are more of like a shorts trainer, personally, or a tracksuit trainer. So just having a quick look at the sole, because I remember the last time I'd done a review, I was a bit annoyed because I was thinking the sole wasn't too smooth and this one's smooth but I can still see a little bit of a little bit of imperfections there as you can see. I mean nothing to moan about it's just me being fussy but that's the TNs right there. Have a close look at the blue ones. Let's have a look at what see what colour this is racer blue and white. There were a few other colourways um I did see a grey colourway I saw all black I saw like a mid blue so there's are some other colourways as well but these seem to be the um, brightest of the bunch. I think I even did see a white pair as well but they had they had all sold out um online anyway but I think they did have them in the store. This material here feels like a bit of a kind of suede type material so that feels really nice and we got this kind of exoskeleton kind of alien pattern going all the way through that makes up the TN so that's that really cool trainer guys if you guys are looking for some TNs these are retailing for 129 over at Foot Locker and Foot Locker seems to be the only place that I know that's selling them I don't know anyone else that is selling these so guys I'm going to be trying these on, on my foot so you can see them on the side and you can see what they're saying okay so that's it man not much else to report really apart from that they're a really cool pair of trainers what do you guys think man is this something that you would rock do you think they're really nice let me know your thoughts i'll be dying to know what you guys think okay so guys that's it for now man i've got a um, stone island review coming i've um, got a stone island lightweight jacket review coming so that's going to be there real soon i've also got some montclair jackets in bam so i've got that one there 
And I've also got, um, I picked up a Montclair Le Blonde, which is this one right here, hold, one, hold tight. I also picked up this jacket right here guys as well, so I picked up this Montclair um, Summer Drop which is quite nice and it's a bit like a Montclair overshirt, really cool. So I'll be reviewing this guys and show you what it's saying but this one is called the Montclair Le Bruin as you can see right there, okay? So that's it for the minute guys, hope you enjoyed this review, hope you found it informative. If you have any questions, give me a shout man, drop me a shout in your description or follow me on the old YouTube or you can send your pictures and follow me on the old Instagram, okay? So that's it for the minute man, I'm gonna catch you lot in a bit, peace out.